Fair, spoiler-free reviews of the newest films. Vaughn on Movies. Brought to you by MovieFilmReview.com When hard-working TV producer Becky Fuller, Rachel McAdams, is fired from her local news program, her career begins to look as bleak as her hapless love life. Stumbling into a job at Daybreak, the last place national morning news show, Becky decides to revitalize the show by bringing on legendary TV anchor Mike Pomeroy, Harrison Ford. Unfortunately, Pomeroy refuses to cover morning show staples like celebrity gossip, weather, fashion, and crafts, let alone work with his co-host Colleen Peck, Diane Keaton, a former beauty queen and longtime morning show personality who is more than happy covering morning news. As Mike and Colleen clash, first behind the scenes and then on the air, Becky's blossoming love affair with a fellow producer begins to unravel. And soon, Becky is struggling to save her relationship, her reputation, her job, and ultimately the show itself. What the heck were they thinking when they came up with this title? The world's toughest movie critic. They could have easily called this movie Daybreak. Instead, they opted for the suggestive Morning Glory and they even put it on the network IBS. You know, these producers have a sick kind of humor to them, but uh, not unlike a show I pitched a few months ago. From the mind that brought you legendary badass, Vaughn on Movies, and Minute with Monty, comes a new comedy, The Clap, this fall on STD. For a girl movie, Morning Glory ain't half bad. And you're probably wondering why I even put up with going to a movie like this with Eat, Pray, Love. So fresh in my mind. Well, I'll tell you what, it's from Bad Robot, and it has Harrison Ford. Indeed, the relationship between Ford and McAdams is what makes this movie work, and his bitterness really has some good comedic value to it. I also laughed at the weatherman who's being turned into a ratings gimmick, forced to do some daredevil activities. However, Diane Keaton really gets the short end of the stick, and that's because the movie focuses on the student-teacher relationship between McAdams and Ford. And before I give out my final score, I have to give a very special shout out to Kenda Perez, the host of the Best of Pride on Spike TV for answering this week's Pop Quiz Hot Shot Trivia Question. If you want to earn a shout out, follow me on Twitter at Vaughn on Movies and be the first to answer the trivia question Sunday's Midnight Central Time. I had a surprisingly good time watching Morning Glory. And yes, this comes from a dude who just sat through a Rachel McAdams vehicle. Maybe it's because I'm intrigued by the inner workings of a studio, or maybe it's because this slightly more serious version of Anchorman isn't bad. In fact, I'm going to give Morning Glory three out of four stars. I'll see you guys next time.